Hello and welcome to the city. The city. Look at this city. Everyone was so excited up to see this city. A city of um, lots of red and gold. Oh my goodness. And I'm sure everyone was excited to see me die, so here we go. Welp. That's basically when escapee telling it's you, nope, it's... you're not supposed to do that. You forgot a thing. Huh? Die and try again. Oh, yeah. To... And you're not supposed to do it that way. <laughs> oh dear. Die, try Return again. To Return to the light. So can you get what we're actually supposed to be doing? Shoot it from this direction? Yep. Because it's so obvious. I mean, come on, it was there. <laughs> Sort of me. Oh, what? Oh, right. No, it, oh, okay. Oh, now we go swimming. Yeah, basically this keeps the alien off our backs for a bit, and we get a neat section. I bet you can drown in that. If you try really hard, you can, but you're not really supposed to. Oh, wow. Some, something in this game that is, is being kind to you. Yeah. Basically, if you drown in this area, you don't even get a death scene, because they didn't plan it. Oh, uh, okay. Well, so much for the city! I will be going back, it's just a little detour. Okay, not regeneration. Yeah. I actually really like this section. It's this kind of sections that remind me how much I love and hate this game. So, I mean, mm. just look at it. The music is so cool, the animation's really nice, the graphics are okay. Yeah, nobody's trying to kill you. Yeah, and then you just go, oh, it's trying to kill me. Why? Well, it's trying to kill me. I wanna like it so much, but you don't like it. <laughs> Uh, you like it, it doesn't like you. Yeah. <laughs> the breaststroke. Return to the, light. Return to the light. Bright lights, big city. Fences. Yeah, you might notice uh, the pattern about this city, it's very... It's a lot of fences. Yep. It's really fancy and drab. So where, where, where did Mystery Ghost with Killy Thing go? Oh, there he is. You had to ask him, didn't you? <laughs> yep. He'll never leave us. He'll just keep bugging what? us. For the entire... Rest of... oh. Yep. A switch. Anyways, a switch. You gotta pull these switches. There's these switches all over the city for some reason. And you gotta pull them for some reason. That I'll explain later. Okay, and that looked like something... Oh! Did, how did you even know to turn around then? Because there was a dog there. Oh, okay. Did you see the dogs. Well, I saw some sort of black and white like thing. Oh. Yeah. Well, I edited out the part where I didn't see the dogs that died, so there. Yeah. Oh, okay. Because oh. it's just the same dog thing. Okay. Oh my goodness, it's a car. It's a car. That's... You're being chased by a Ford Ka. <laughs> it's a car that's smaller than you and shooting lasers for some reason. The city. <laughs> Hot wheels. Um. Yep, that car just. Why? Why? I don't know. I'm not sure why I decided to roll here, but here we are. It breaks up, breaks things up, but. Mm. Yep. Oh, a floating break thing. Things up. Oh, it's our old friend, the annoying floating thing. And annoying floating bottomless electric pit. Uh, bottomless pit. Because what would a city? This time your death bits. comes from a different angle, you're sort of looking down on it. What's over here? Can you street? guess? Oh, him. Yep. More streets, more him. Oh boy. I'm sure you've noticed the pattern. More fans. And a thing. And a, oh, a thing. Strange symbols. As usual. I don't, I don't really know what to make of this. Middle one was like a UFO, maybe, and the le last one looks like something out of Hangman. Yeah. The annoying thing is the symbols often really don't look much like the actual symbols in the puzzle later. You like it? Oh, they more dogs. More dogs. And a map. Oh, a map. Basically, this clues you in on how fucked you are because look at the layout of this shit. It's not even. Oh. Uh, <laughs> and it's a 2D game, and you only really tell you going in a certain direction. Suddenly, you'll find yourself in a different. Plane and oh, yeah. Uh, I actually, have to write down a, a map for this game. You know what the best part is? How did he get behind you? Because he's an alien. Anyways, you want to know what the best part he is? Can fly. Um. Okay. Yes, I suppose I do. <laughs> Even with a map written down, I managed to get 
confused and lost in this game because uh look at it everyone everything looks the same and like you said the map goes every direction while you only go 2d so it gets really uh <laughs> you're not sure where you're going anymore i mean just look at it keep switching and layering and uh and everything looks the same so yeah, yeah. The city. The city. Trying to trying to get a, a reference on the geography of this place seems oh. Yep. There's also these pets that just lead you to a bit because they thought that wouldn't be fun. Return to the light. Return to the light. Random yeah. just random bit of vocals. The, oh, yeah. it's that car again. That's another thing, the, the whole city has that one music that doesn't get repetitive at all. Yep, people were looking forward to section O, and so was I. Oh, Ooh. shooting thing. Just, just duck underneath them. That, that seems to do the trick. Yeah. I'll do all these get damage for going through them. But... And that one has made a green blobby stuff. Mm. It's the easiest way to stop when you're running. You just drop and pull. Yeah. Get in a shooting position. Boy, this is exciting. That shooting was so exciting. So excited. Especially even with the shield, you still lose half. Is that green go go going to turn into another scary purple angel thing, or not? No, they're just smashed up. Because it seems similar to the red goo from earlier. Nah. We'll never see it again. That's good. Although we will keep seeing that alien, but yeah. Yeah. Would be a bit odd if two of them started following you. Mm. Oh, well, we did it free or something, I don't know. We don't even know. And we don't even know why there's a regen inside some house. But there it is. Well, quite handy having a regen inside your house. Feeling a bit under the weather? Just pop in the regen. <laughs> well, this whole city seems to be under the weather. Just look at it. Uh, You'd expect more from a futuristic is... city, but nope. Senses and blue and these guys. Anyways, remember the code from earlier? Well, oh. here it is. Okay. Uh, the thing on the, um... That seems about right. And now you gotta do the one on that side. It's actually really easy even if you don't see the code because it starts off with most of the symbols right. Can we well, get a bridge? A bridge. A bridge that fades in and out of existence. Yep, so useful. <laughs> this game. Basically, that bridge serves as a one-way shortcut if you're really quick, and it's mostly pointless otherwise. So, well, well, why do you spend all that time looking for a code for that bridge? That uh, this game. Why fences? At least now they're different kind of fences. Yeah, it makes a change from the wooden fences. Oh, we still, oh, yeah, we have lots of really good uh, thing, but it's, it's it's nicely drawn. Yeah. Oh, here he comes again. Gotta jump. keep this the action going. <laughs> and fail at jumping. Oh. You can actually jump that bit, I just stepped it. So I'll do it right this time. Well, good luck. But yeah, I guess they, they put the alien in random spots in the city to keep the action going, because otherwise it's pretty dull. Hmm. And by action I mean, ah, you're gonna die all the time. Oh, more flaming barrels. Oh, another switch. Not a video game without flaming barrels. You also gotta be careful with the switches because you might accidentally back down at them and think of pressing them again. Yeah. That, what if? What happens if you press one you've already pressed? Well, basically you wouldn't do that. And you'll you have to go back later and press it again, basically. Okay. It's just annoying that the game lets you undo your switches. Uh, but sure, can't you just remember, like, if... Is it like down is off and on is up, and up is on? Yeah. I just mean, because this game is so repetitive, you might get forget about it and go, uh... Okay, yeah, I see what you mean. Also, yeah. this ball is really annoying and not letting me go. It's but just it's... tracking you to the end of the earth. Yeah. It's on a mission. Well, there's another region in this house. That should help, yeah. Whoop. And I figure out how to get rid of the ball later, but it's really annoying. Because usually they let you go, but this one, damn. This one is persistent. <laughs> Pretty persistent. I mean, he just wants to say hi, yeah, and this is the only way, it's the only thing you can do. Eh? Oh, got in front of you. Oh, man. 
Just Still get good. away from me. I don't like you. I don't feel that way about you. <laughs> oh, let's look at the map. Mm, we're complete. Right, let's shoot this thing. Fine. There we go. And Why did you even... do that in the first place? Because it's really hard to get a distance on it. Okay, fair enough. But yeah, yep. look at this map. better map. It's even more amazing. It's Still got it's bits missing, but... Yep. You can see some bits we've been through, like the pits and the bridge. And yeah. That's about it. There's pretty much no landmarks in this game, and it doesn't even tell you where the <laughs> switches are, so you have to go through everywhere. Like there's there, one. there's a switch. Ah. Uh, <laughs> this game. Tell me, Paul, how would you feel if we had to go exploring an alien city looking for switches for some reason? Wouldn't that be exciting? <laughs> <laughs> It would be, uh, I, I really, I think I would have got insane by this point, if this was real life. Mm. And how would you feel perhaps if, he, perhaps, for some perhaps reason... he has gone insane. Yeah. And especially, how would you feel if you lived, oh, oh. These... How would you feel if you lived in an alien city full of bottomless pits for some reason? <laughs> oh, well, I just hate bottomless pits on principle, so, um... Oh, and this bit again. <laughs> Don't mind that I'm oh. running in circles. <laughs> I, I wonder if, wait a minute, that sequence of oh, those barrels again. Yep. Oh, well, at least we, we know you've done that switch already because it's up. Yeah. Sometimes you don't really get much of a choice in backtracking, I guess. Yeah. I'm just terrible at video games. <sighs> to be fair, this is a video game in which it is easy to be terrible at video games. Mm -hmm. Anyways, let's see if I find a way out. Or, well, another way, because there's no real way out. Uh, that map looks familiar. Oh, and that switch. Yep. What's the... Uh... Yeah, basically I'm supposed to go down here and not left again. How many of these switches are there in total? Uh, eight. We've done three so far, I think. Yep. Oh, the, the... See, see this thing? You see that thing, the circle thing? That shows you the switches you've got and the ones you have left. Oh, okay. Basically, you have to pull the switches so this thing works. It's basically your excuse of going, Oh, nope, you can't just shortcut here. You have to go through the whole city. Uh, okay. 